Why were pandas merges in Python faster than data.table merges in R in 2012? I recently came across the pandas library for Python, which according to this benchmark performs very fast in memory merges. It's even faster than the data.table package in R, my language of choice for analysis. Why is pandas so much faster than data.table? Is it because of an inherent speed advantage Python has over R, or is there some trade-off I'm not aware of? Is there a way to perform inner and outer joins in data.table without resorting to mergex, y, all equals false, and mergex, y, all equals true? Here's the R code and the Python code used to benchmark the various packages. It looks like Wes may have discovered a known issue in data.table when the number of unique strings, levels, is large, 10,000. Does Reprof reveal most of the time spent in the call sorted match levels ILC, levels XRC? This isn't really the join itself, the algorithm, but a preliminary step. Recent efforts have gone into allowing character columns in keys, which should resolve that issue by integrating more closely with R's own global string hash table. Some benchmark results are already reported by test.data.table but that code isn't hooked up yet to replace the levels to levels match. R pandas merges faster than data.table for regular integer columns. That should be a way to isolate the algorithm self versus factor issues. Also, data.table has time series merge in mind. Two aspects to that, i, multi-column ordered keys such as, id, date time to, fast prevailing join, role equals true, aka last observation carried forward. I'll need some time to confirm as it's the first I've seen of the comparison to data.table as presented. Update from data.table v1.8.0 released July 2012. Internal function sorted match removed and replaced with chmatch when matching i levels to x levels for columns of type factor. This preliminary step was causing a known significant slowdown when the number of levels of a factor column was large, for example and gt 10,000. Exacerbated in tests of joining four such columns, as demonstrated by Wes McKinney, author of Python Package Pandas. Matching 1 million strings of which of which 600,000 are unique is now reduced from 16s to 0s.5s, for example. Also in that release was Character columns are now allowed in keys and are preferred to factor. Data.table and set key no longer coerce character to factor. Factors are still supported. Implements FR number 1493, FR number 1224 and, partially, FR number 951. New functions to match and percent chin percent. Faster versions of match and percent in percent for character vectors. R's internal string cache is utilized, no hash table is built. They are about four times faster than match on the example in. Chmatch. As of SEP 2013 data.table is v1.8.10 on CRAN and we're working on v1.9.0. News is updated live. But as I wrote originally, above. Data.table has time series merge in mind. Two aspects to that, i, multi-column ordered keys such as, id, date time to, fast prevailing join, role equals true, aka last observation carried forward. So the pandas equa join of two character columns is probably still faster than data.table since it sounds like it hashes the combined two columns. Data.table doesn't hash the key because it has prevailing ordered joins in mind. 
A P in data dot table is literally just the sort order, similar to a clustered index in SQL, i.e., that's how the data is ordered in RAM. On the list is to add secondary keys, for example. In summary, the glaring speed difference highlighted by this particular two-character column test with over 10,000 unique strings shouldn't be as bad now, since the known problem has been fixed. The reason pandas is faster is because I came up with a better algorithm, which is implemented very carefully using a fast hash table implementation, clip and in C slash Cython to avoid the Python interpreter overhead for the non-vectorizable parts. The algorithm is described in some detail in my presentation, a look inside pandas design and development. The comparison with data.table is actually a bit interesting because the whole point of R's data.table is that it contains pre-computed indexes for various columns to accelerate operations like data selection and merges. In this case, database joins, pandas data frame contains no pre-computed information that is being used for the merge, so to speak it's a cold merge. If I had stored the factorized versions of the join keys, the join would be significantly faster as factorizing is the biggest bottleneck for this algorithm. I should also add that the internal design of Pandas data frame is much more amenable to these kinds of operations than R's data.frma, which is just a list of arrays internally. This topic is two years old but seems like a probable place for people to land when they search for comparisons of pandas and data.table. Since both of these have evolved over time, I want to post a relatively newer comparison, from 2014, here for the interested users, this URL. It would be interesting to know if Wes and or Matt, who, by the way, are creators of pandas and data.table respectively and have both commented above, have any news to add here as well. Update. A comment posted below by Jangoretsky contains a link that I think is very useful, this URL. This graph depicts the average times of aggregation and join operations for different technologies, lower equals faster, comparison last updated in SEP 2016. It was really educational for me. Going back to the question, are DT key and RDT refer to the keyed slash unkeyed flavors of R's data dot table and happen to be faster in this benchmark than Python's pandas? Hi pandas. There are great answers, notably made by authors of both tools that question asks about. Matt's answer explained the case reported in the question that it was caused by a bug, and not a merge algorithm. Bug was fixed on the next day, more than a seven years ago already. In my answer I will provide some up-to-date timings of merging operation for data.table and pandas. Note that plier and base are merge are not included. Timings I am presenting are coming from DB Benchmark Project, a continuously run reproducible benchmark. It upgrades tools to recent versions and rerun benchmark scripts, it runs many other software solutions. If you are interested in Spark, Dask and few others be sure to check the link. As of now. Still to be implemented, one more data size and five more questions. We test two different data sizes of LHS table. For each of those data sizes we run five different merge questions. Q1. LHS inner join RHS small on integer Q2, LHS inner join RHS medium on integer Q3, LHS outer join RHS medium on integer Q4, LHS inner join RHS medium on factor, categorical, Q5, LHS inner join RHS big on integer. RHS table is of three various sizes.
small translates to size of LHS slash 1E6, medium translates to size of LHS slash 1E3, big translates to size of LHS. In all cases there are around 90% of matching rows between LHS and RHS, and no duplicates in RHS joining column, no Cartesian product. As of now, run on 2nd of November 2019. Pandas 0.25.3 released on 1st of November 2019. Data.table 0.12.7, 92 ab 70, released on 2nd of November 2019. Below timings are in seconds, for two different data sizes of LHS. Column PD2DT is added field storing ratio of how many times pandas is slower than data.table. 0.5 GB LHS data. Five GB LHS data. Thank you.